Hello Pilates and yoga lovers, welcome to my channel. Annie Pilates Physical Therapist join me for a quick 10 minute feel good Pilates to lengthen and strengthen your upper back, low back and hips muscles at the same time strengthening your core safely and effectively if you are short in time and you need a quick boost for the day. So get your mat ready and join me. Okay, my friends, let's slowly roll down, chin tuck, and lie on your back as you breathe out. Place your hands behind your thighs as you roll down slowly. Arms overhead to stretch your upper back. As you inhale, slowly bend your knees together, double tabletop, and then at the same time, hands pointing to the ceiling. Inhale, and then exhale, slowly tap your feet down to the mat and your hands overhead as you breathe out. Inhale, lift again, double tabletop, hands pointing to the ceiling. Exhale, tap down. Squeezing your core in, keeping your neutral spine. Slowly tap down as you lift your hands overhead to stretch your upper back. Inhale, squeeze forward. Lift your knees, hands pointing to the ceiling. Exhale down, four more. Breathe in and then breathe out. Tap. Keeping in mind that core engagement with your breath work. Two more. Inhale. Exhale down. Last one. And exhale down. Now lift again. Double tabletop. This time, let's challenge your core by lifting your shoulders, hands pointing to the ceiling. And gently open your knees apart and hands apart, squeezing your core for a butterfly position. And then back to the center and squeeze your core in as you go back center. Inhale, exhale out, keeping your shoulders up, chin tuck, protect your neck and your back. Inhale and then exhale as you breathe out, open. Four more. Three, two, Last one, and hold it there. Place your hands behind your head, clasp your fingers, keeping your shoulders off the mat, and gently tap left and right. Single leg, reverse tabletop, keeping your core engaged by lifting your shoulders off the mat. As you breathe in, tap, exhale, lift back to tabletop. Five more. Each leg. Four more, tap, three, two, last one, and down, slowly place your feet down, hands beside you, shoulders relax on your back, gentle bridge as you lift your glutes off the mat, squeezing your core in, try not to overarch your spine as you lift as high as you can. Squeezing your core in, squeezing your glutes as well. And then gently go down one vertebrae at a time, bone to bone to the mat as you breathe out. Inhale, lift your glutes, your hips. Squeezing everything tight together, engaging them with your breath work. As you breathe out, one vertebrae as you slowly go down. Four more, lift, and then down. Three more, lift, and down. Three more. Feel so good on your back and your glutes, strengthening your back muscles and your core. Last one and lift and this time my friends hold that bridge keeping your hips off the mat gently lift alternating your heel off the mat tippy toes heel raises left and right while holding that bridge squeezing your core in and squeezing your glutes as you breathe in and breathe out four more each foot three more Two more, keeping everything centered. Last one. 
and now gently pulse your hips up and down small range as you squeeze and let go gently halfway through and then lift again feel the burn on your glutes and your core engage four more of small pulses not fast slow and gentle as you pulse two more last one and hold that and then slowly go down one vertebrae at a time as you rest up. Well done. Now grab your knee towards your chest. One hand at the top of your knee, one at the inner side of your ankle. So my left hand on top of my left knee, my right hand on the inner side of my ankle. Gently lift your shoulders off the mat, chin tuck. And then the other leg, straighten your knee as you breathe in. And then breathe out, switch to the other side. This time, my right hand on top of my knee and my left hand on the inner side of my ankle. And then switch. Inhale and exhale. Now we're gonna speed it up. Bicycle. Keeping your core engaged, lift your shoulders if you can. And if this hurts in your neck, you can rest your head down. But for those who wanna challenge the day for a quick, Feel good, Pilates. Let's do this. Five more. Four. Three. Two. Last one. And one. Now slowly extend one leg. I'm lengthening my left knee, holding my left leg, both hands, and then lengthening the other leg down. You can tap your foot down on the mat or keep it hovering a few inches off the mat for scissoring. And let's warm up. But alternating, switch to the other side and then lengthening and lowering the other leg. Inhale, lift. <laughs> Exhale, down. Switch as you go up. Holding tight with your hands, keeping your knees straight. If your knees are a little bit buckled, that's fine. Four more. Switch. And if it's hurting your neck, you can head Place your head down to rest, but try to engage your core and lift your head and shoulder off the mat. Two more. Last one. Now we're gonna speed it up by a gentle, quick stretch. So I'm just gonna stretch my right leg, hamstring stretch, two, and then switch faster. One, two. Quick stretch as you switch. Feel that lovely stretch. One leg stretch. Two more. Last one. And down. Well done. Hug your knees to your chest. Lower your feet down. We are cooling down now. Arms to your side like a W position. Gently lower both knees in one side as you turn your head in one side. Breathe in. Breathe out to the center. Switch to the other side. Exhale to the center. Feels so good on your back and your hips lengthen. The other side. Feels so good on your neck as well as you to the center. Last set. And last one to the other side. Well done. Now we're going to hug your feet together, knees apart for a butterfly stretch. Feel so good in your inner thighs and rock side to side. Inhale and exhale. Two more. Last breath in. Now place your hands, clasp it on your big toes. Pull your knees towards down the mat, keep it bent, feet facing up the ceiling, happy baby pose, and rock side to side. Inhale and exhale. Feels so good on your back and your hips. Now gently extend both legs up, knees straighten to the ceiling, and do a gentle ankle pumps with your knees straight. Place your hands behind your thighs. Pump up and down with your breathing. Two more. 
and then circles ankle circles you can start clockwise and then reverse now gently let go of your hands place it beside your hips on the side of the mat toes pointing you as to slowly open your feet apart knee straight for V stretch and then tip your toes away and then gently place back to the center inhale torso flex open your legs apart tippy toes plantar flex and then back center with your breathing four more three two and one and then slowly bend your knees place it down to the mat figure four i'm starting with my right leg Gently press your knee out to a figure four position. Feel that love to stretch across your back. As you breathe in, as you breathe out, hug your knees to your chest. Feel a deep stretch on your piriformis muscles. And then you can rock side to side for a deeper stretch. If this is too difficult, just continue pushing your knee out in the figure four for absolute beginners. Now slowly lower your feet down and then switch to the other side. Figure four, press your knee out to feel a lovely square on your pelvis behind your back. Inhale and exhale. Slowly hug your knees to your chest. Feel a deep stretch on your left side this time, left glutes, your piriformis muscles. And then slowly rock side to side if you can. Inhale and exhale. Slowly lower your foot down and your feet. And that's it. I'm hoping you enjoyed this quick feel good Pilates. For those who are short in time, you want to have a productive therapy and Pilates to add in your daily routine. This is great if you need some relief on your low back, hips and upper back muscles. If you love this video and want to learn more about Pilates, yoga, and physical therapy, health and wellness, please subscribe to my channel, ring the bell so you won't miss anything. Like and share this video, it will help my channel grow tremendously and it will be shared more around the world and you can help more people and help me keep doing what I love. And I have more videos you can follow along for posture series. Check out the link below in the description if you have more time today to add on this routine. If you have any questions, suggestions, or concerns, or video requests, leave a comment down below or direct message me on my social media and I'll try my best to answer each one of you. Always remember, be safe, be well, and healthy. Until next time, bye!